Now here's another question um, from Chinema USA. Hello, Pastor Chris. Thank you for this great opportunity to have our questions answered. Could you please shed more light on the subject of worship and the saints being worshippers of God? Jesus said that the true worshippers will worship God in the spirit and in truth. What does it mean to worship God in spirit and in truth? What does it mean to worship God with your life? Well, to worship God in spirit and in truth means to worship God from your spirit and in reality. And how do you worship God in reality? Through the word. So that's what it means, very simply put. But it's important that I read to you um, the scriptures. Again, you, you, your question is, what does it mean to worship God with your life? Okay. I'll read to you from Romans chapter 12, from verse 2. And be not conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind, that ye may prove what is that good and perfect, uh, good and acceptable and perfect will of God. Now, why did he say, be not conformed to this world? Because of something he said. Because you notice verse 2 starts with the word and. Something he said in verse 1. And that will enlighten you. I beseech you therefore, brethren, by the mercies of God, that ye present your bodies a living sacrifice. Your bodies. Present your bodies. How can you who present your body? Your spirit. God expects you to live from your spirit. And so he says, you present your body. So you're not a body. Your body belongs to you. Present your body a living sacrifice, holy, acceptable unto God, which is your reasonable service. And a better rendering, the newer version says, which is your spiritual act of worship. So it's an act of worship when you present your body. And who does the presenting? Your spirit. Now, that's important because if you turn to the book of Romans chapter number 1, he gives you a light to this from verse 9. He says, For God is my witness, whom I serve with my spirit in the gospel of his son. I serve with my spirit. I serve God with my spirit. How do you serve God with your spirit? By doing things from your spirit. See, like one, he says, present your body. Your spirit does the presentation. And then when you worship God, you worship in the spirit. For example, Paul says, uh, I'll sing with the spirit and I'll sing with the understanding also. See, so we worship God from our spirits. If you would go to 1 Peter chapter 2 and verse 5, it says, Ye also as living stones are built up a spiritual house and holy priesthood to offer up spiritual sacrifices acceptable to God by Jesus Christ because he's, he's made us priests unto him. So we are worshippers, you see. So we render spiritual service, spiritual service, spiritual worship. So always remember that. He says to serve God with your spirit. That's the way you serve him with your spirit. By living in the word. See, you walk in the word. And it's, the, it's your spirit that responds to the word of God. Your spirit responds to the word of God. That's why we say that faith is a response of the human spirit to the word of God.